Yes. <laughs> uh, all right. All jokes aside, this is Alyssa coming to you live on a moment with Teens of Honor, just sharing with you about being focused. Joshua one eight says, "Do not let this book of the law depart from your mouth. Meditate on it day and night, so that you may be careful to do everything written in it. Then you will be prosperous and successful." And so I'm tying that scripture into being focused. You might be thinking, "How does that go together?" Well. The book of the law, or I'm going to use this for instance in a more real life example, goals or the laws of wealth or the secrets of being wealthy and being successful or the tips to having a successful marriage or tips towards eating healthy or tips towards ha having a deeper spiritual relationship with God. Whatever it is that you're focusing on, that is your book of the law. Don't let it depart from your mouth basically means don't forget to talk about it. Don't forget to think about it. Don't forget to focus on it. And then it goes on to say, meditate on it day and night. Basically, think about it every day, every night, all throughout the day. Think about it as often as you possibly can. Why? So that you can do everything written in it. Or that you can do everything that your goal is trying to make you work towards or make you aspire to be or to become. Why? Because when you do that, you will be prosperous and successful. Somebody won't, uh, once broke down the word focus into an acronym, which means following one course until successful. I'm going to say it again. Following one course until successful. When you follow one course until you succeed at it, or focusing on one specific thing until you achieve your desired result, you can't be successful until you do that. But once you make the conscious decision to do that, to focus on one thing until successful, you will achieve success. Jack Canfield, who helped author uh, Chicken Soup for the Soul, he once set a goal to sell, I think it was a million copies of the book within, I think it was, you know, a few months' time. And he didn't achieve that goal exactly at one million copies. He got close to like 800,000, I believe. And so somebody asked him, Jack, you didn't reach your goal, so do you quit or you know, what are you going to do? And he said, well, I think I can live with this type of failure because it's going to push me to get to the next goal that I set. So again, he set another goal to sell more copies. And within, I believe it was like, I think he set a three month goal and within like 60 days or two months, he sold over three million copies of, this, of the book. And he far surpassed his goal because I think his goal was only like 2.5 million and he sold like 3.8 or something like that. And so basically he said, I can live with the temporary failure of not getting exactly to the goal that I set because I set a goal. At least I got close enough. So that way when I set my next goal, I have more determination to go towards it and achieve that goal. So basically, be like Jack Canfield. Be like the Bible says in Joshua 1.8 following that one course until successful. Don't let the book of the law, whatever law or whatever thing that you're trying to focus on, don't let it depart from your thoughts, don't let it depart from your mouth, but meditate or focus on it every day and every night so that you may be careful or be conscious to do everything that you're setting out to do so that you can be prosperous and successful. So I hope these tips really encouraged you and helped you on your personal journey. Be sure that you Focus on whatever it is that you're setting out to do, not just making a resolution to do it, but focus, set a goal to accomplish it, and when you follow that one course until successful, you will be successful by the end of your goal time and your goal period. So be sure to focus on your dreams and goals and work towards them every day in every way. This has been Alyssa Russell on A Moment with Teens of Honor. Be sure to like comment and subscribe and also be sure to share this video with your friends and family members so that they can be encouraged to focus on their dreams their visions and their goals as well until next time now go make something happen Yeah.